Hello, viewer, and welcome back to Games with Dialogue. This is episode 63 of my RPG Maker series. Last time, I finished constructing the inn in the Skill Shrine City. This time, I think I'm going to work on the populace a little, flesh out the residents and the homes. While in the background, uh, off camera, I continue to work on building the puzzles for the Skill Shrine itself. So let's not waste any more time and dive right in. Okay. One thing that I forgot to do was add in some soldiers. This being a imperial town like Naho, except that they kind of embraced the uh, the bad guys. So what I think I'm going to do is get rid of this guy up front and put in a soldier add a few more soldiers uh in here and around town uh, i think it's important that uh we have oh, i went too far uh, i think it's important that we have some of them running around just to get the point across that uh actually you know what i think i want one of the generals there we go uh just to get the point across that this isn't uh this isn't a safe city for the main characters. Um, just two? Ah, we'll have the whole front seat. I think that's fine. Let's see here. Oh, I went too far again. I keep going too far. All right. There we go. Good. All right. Uh, I think that's fine. Yeah, I think that's fine. Just one little squad here. I need somebody for in here. Um, what am I going to do, though? I've got... Maybe... No, I don't want to put her in there. Uh, that's all the main characters. Let's see. I could do... Well, she's also a shopkeeper. I want to stay away from that. Um... Yeah, I don't have, like, a just plain old cook, do I? Huh. Well. I suppose I could use... Ah, well. All right. So, that's not going to work. What about uh, sci-fi? I want to... As I said before, I want to shy away from that. I want to try to keep away from it because I don't want any sci-fi elements slipping in, but on the same time. Yeah, I don't I don't see any. I don't see any that works. Okay. Well, I'll just pick one then. Let's do Let's do Let's do this one. Sure. Why not? Alright, good. I want to get him set up for the inn. I want to get them most of them. Maybe all of them to have uh, dialogue. But I also want... Now, let's go back to the outside of the town. Uh, I want to establish some housing for the civilians. So I think we'll start here and work our way around. This one, I need a window. I, I didn't even think about that. I need a window. Let's put this right here and these guys also need a window i think let's put hmm let's put one of these right here yeah not together not together right there and right there and like that okay good so i need a new building and we'll call it Residence A, Residence 1. Um, I will alphabetize them, I think. Residence A. Display name, I don't know. When we come up with a town name, I'll have something for it. Uh, inside, width, height, we'll just fix that when we get here. And now I need good floors. 
something that says we have a lot of money. Uh, let's see. I also think I want it to be 20 wide and maybe 17 tall. So do I want wood floors or do I want stone floor? I think wood would be better. Yeah, I think wood's better. All right, let's do here like this. And then what looks better? Yeah, that's okay, but I think it works better as a small amount. What about this? No, I think that's too rural, too rustic. We could go with this, I guess. But again, I if I hold down shift, does it change it at all? It does, but not in the way I want it to. I want to get rid of these bars here. The separation is bothering me. Uh, what does, what does the outside look like? It's brick. So maybe I should just do brick on the inside. Yeah, okay. But if I do that, then I, the floor is not, it doesn't work. The floor doesn't work if I do that. What if, well, I don't know. Some of these. Yeah, I was afraid of that. Okay, that doesn't work. Some of these are, floors are fine. Yeah, this doesn't work either. Some of these are just not what I'm looking for. What if I do this? Does it combine or does it... No, it just looks like a... Yeah, that's not going to work either. All right, well... I don't know. I don't know. I guess I'll go with... I guess I'll go with this. No, because it's just like outside, and I want it to be different than outside. Hmm. All right, well, how does the wood flooring uh, look different than this? I guess it's okay. What about this one? Nah. I want something that's more like this. But even that's not okay. I want it to look different from the outside, from the city streets. So I need something visually distinct, but also that matches the uh, brick house aesthetic. What about this? Eh. I I think it would work well if it was like a smaller amount, but that's too much. All right, we're just going to go with the wood. We'll just go with the wood and then go from there. So what do I want to do about the inside of the building? What if we have, I actually need this on the roof because we need to, yeah, good. Okay. Well, we need a front, right? We need a front door. Well, let me do that, actually. We also need... It's not straight across with this one, so what if I do... What if I do that? Hmm. Okay. And then I need to come over here with this also. So, maybe something like, maybe just one more? Uh, I think that's fine. I think that's fine. Then we'll do that. Then we'll do, well, you know what? No, no, no. No, no, no. Uh, where are you? We'll move this over one more. Like so. No, no. Right there is fine. Okay. All right. I mean, I can change it later. You know, it's not, it's not set in stone, but 
We can change it later. But that means I want... That means I want uh, a tiny little room over here, I think. It could be a bedroom for a kid, right? Uh, if I do... If I do like that, and then... There we go. Uh, this could be a bedroom also. If I come over like this. Okay. And then... Should I make it two stories? I think it would work better if it was two stories. So maybe what I want to do is put the set of stairs back here. Yeah, alright. Alright, alright. I'm going to put the stairs back there. So it'll be like this. Actually, I want that there. I'll put the stairs back there. Uh, this one. Yes, okay. And then... We will probably have the remaining bedrooms upstairs. We could actually have all the bedrooms upstairs. So this could be like a storage room. Uh, I want a living room. If you come... Alright, if you come in... What's over here? What if I put uh, just a wall here? Well, actually, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna need... Okay. If I put that there. All right. Uh, I'm gonna make this too wide to work more as a pillar for upstairs. No, you know what? Uh, I think, dead. what I want to do... Yeah, alright. I, I haven't done something like that in a while. Just make it a little different. Just a little different. Um, so what will this be? Could be the kitchen. We could have the kitchen over here. Uh, but if I do have the kitchen over here... Then I think I want it instead to go like this. So the entryway, I could have... I could have it like so. Well, what if I... Hmm. Okay, all right, wait, wait. Ah, uh, this is turning into, ah, uh, it's, ah, uh, okay, all right. It's turning into a dungeon. This is not, this is not what I want. This is not what I want. Let me, uh, let me back up here. Let me back up here. Let me back up here. Okay, so the outside of the house is brick, but that doesn't mean, that doesn't mean the inside has to be brick, right? Right, we can do, we can do it like a normal, yeah, I like that better. I like that much, much better. Ugh, I, <laughs> I, there's no reason to make it, there's no reason to make it brick. None. Uh, don't want to do that. I, yeah, that's better. Okay. I still am going to need like this though. Okay. So what if I don't have a storage room over here? What if I have the storage room over here? I have a kitchen back here. Oh, it could be the library. It can be the library. I just need... I just need some extra room. So the divider goes there. Like so. Okay. Let's try to put the library together so I can see how that looks. Well, maybe not that. Put it right there. Put this right there. There we go. Yeah, I like that better. I need some chairs. There we go. 
put uh huh that is a problem isn't it if i put the chair like this what is it facing what sense does that make yeah all right i'll get rid of that we can have a clock though no we can't uh, all right it really doesn't help that i basically have one wall i can decorate um i'm gonna put i'm gonna put the blue here i like the blue and it makes it feel more regal in my mind and that's fine i actually put it right there against that okay actually should i yeah i think that's okay we'll go for the full I'll go for the full room. So I need a window, but I also need some place for people to sit. I forget if there's any chairs over here. Beds, carpet. Uh, more beds, more carpet. Yeah, I don't see any. Okay. I am limited in the number of chairs, the number and the type. So I will just put one there, one there, and one there. Interesting. Why does this not get... Huh. That might... Uh, you know, that might break the illusion if the uh, chairs aren't in shadow. So, maybe... I don't want to do that. I'll put them there. Okay. Um. Books on a bookshelf? Nah. I do need a window, though. We'll do... Yeah, we'll do that one. Right there. Okay. I kind of want this piano to be somewhere in the house. Maybe right there. Maybe against the back wall. Maybe right here in the entry. No, not in the entryway. Actually, in the entryway. Okay. That works for me. It's kind of ugly, but at the same time... People who track their muddy boots in here, I doubt the people who own the house are going to care all that much. It's uh, disposable. So we'll have... You know what? I don't want to do that. Uh, I want to do this. We'll have a table in the front. And... Where am I going to put that piano? I think this is fine. Uh... I want I want a dining table. We'll do right here. No, let's move it away from the wall one more. Okay, that works. And then one, two, one there, one there. And, okay. Then we can decorate it with some food. Well, ah, that'll work. That'll work. Nope, nope. Ugh. I hit the button too. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Uh, One there. And... Yeah, I'll put it right there. Sure. Uh, and then a big old bowl. Well. No, I think that's fine. One more. Right there. Okay. Safe. Good. Great. Fantastic. Uh, I think I actually want... Yes. Okay. And then I want a oven. 
right there. And the sink and whatnot. Hmm. I actually don't have a whole lot of room back here, do I? The problem is, again, I have one wall to decorate. I can't turn these sideways so that they run along the side of the wall. <sighs> All right. That's fine. Whatever. I'll just... Whatever. Huh... Let's get rid of this. And I can put... Well, that was dumb. Huh. Can I not get it centered on the... Ah, oh, I can't. I can't. Ah! Oh. Ah, oh, that's so aggravating. Um... Well, in that case... I'm gonna get rid of this. And... Let's put the rest of the kitchen in. And then redo the divider. If I put it this way, is it going to look bad? Uh, I guess not. It doesn't look too terrible. Uh, but I want to move it down one more. One more. Yeah, okay. Um, same with this. I want to move this like that. Okay. Let's actually get rid of that. We'll have, uh, that'll work. Another rug. Um, I want to have some storage stuff like barrels and whatnot down here. That'll work. All right. Save. Good. Let's go upstairs. I can finish decorating later, but let's go upstairs. Uh, so, A2, maybe? Let's do new. Residence A2. Okay. Inside. We had a width of 20 and a height of, what, 17? I'll do that again. Okay. So we're going to make all the bedrooms up here, right? I mean, it's hard for me to care about this because literally it's just somebody that we aren't going to care about. But I guess for the sake of... Uh, Keeping everything real. Uh, what's a better word for that? Uh, making sure... Making sure that the whole town seems fleshed out. Uh, and alive. And... Uh, I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't matter. Uh, we, we do this because otherwise... As a player, when you walk around town and... You only have the narrow path for the story. You start to ask question whether or not it, it takes you out of the uh, takes you out of the world, it takes you out of it breaks your immersion. That's what I was trying to say. It breaks your immersion. So how am I going to do this? Are the bedrooms going to run left to right? Are they going to be scattered all over the place? I think this one will lead to a bedroom, like so. Uh, we can come down into a bedroom here. Actually, I think, yeah, okay. Um, we'll use... We'll use the same carpet for the bedroom. And we'll use the fancy bed. Right there. 
Um, okay. So that's one bedroom. Ah, shoot. That's one bedroom. This is another one. Actually, that's not going to work, is it? It's too close. Uh, this could be another bedroom. But how big do I want it? It's the master bedroom for mom and dad. I think that's fine. Yeah, this will be fine. Oh. Maybe... Maybe a tiny little room back here. For them. Like a closet or something. Ah, that's too small. <sighs> too small. I guess it's the problem with... I guess it's a problem with walls that are too high. It, it, this is just too small. I mean... It's not a deal breaker. It's just annoying. But we'll have the double bed right there. Okay. The more bedrooms I add, the more people I have to actually make for this room, right? So, I don't want to go overboard. Uh, mommy and Daddy live there. Nope. We're going to have... I don't know. I don't know. Uh, one more bedroom, but uh, I want it to be this section here. So, maybe we do like so. Okay. Okay. And yeah. Okay. So what's over here? Yeah, okay. I want to do Right, right, okay. I think that's good. So what's this? Uh, I guess it could just be a storage room, right? Like extra... Oh, oh, yeah, 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 okay. We can just have uh, extra linens and stuff, right? Plenty of bedrooms have just extra blankets, extra pillows. Um, maybe... I don't see anything else that'll fit in there like a like a bedroom closet. I'll have a wardrobe. No. Huh. What would work? What would work? A hat rack? No, that would work better downstairs. Huh. A closet with clothing, of course. Okay. So what's normal clothing here that I can just hang on the wall? This thing? Maybe. Uh, a suit? Okay, well there was another one over here somewhere. Where did I, ah, here we are. Yeah, all right, sure. I guess I shrug and say, oh, okay, sure, that works fine. Um, we'll have, we'll have the doll right there. And, uh, let's see here. A little vanity mirror, maybe? Over here. Ah, shoot. I gotta move that. That's not gonna work right there. We'll put it right over here. Hmm. Alright, so what about the boys' room? Maybe something like this? Well, if I'm gonna do that, I'm, I wanna put it right there. Uh, we'll do... Well, he kinda blends into... Ah, forget it. 
Um, let's see. A toy box? This is a toy box, right? Does that look like a toy box? It doesn't matter. Who? Nobody's going to question it. It's a... It's a box full of something. I hope nobody questions it. I want a wardrobe. Actually, for the parents, I think I want a wardrobe. Right there. For the kid, I think just having one of these is good enough. Uh, yeah, all right, so save. So, I need to decide what everybody's doing when the player enters. Uh, I think everybody will just be sitting down to dinner. I think that's the easiest way to do things. So let's add a kid. If I can remember which one the kids are. I think that's under people. Uh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> yeah, that'll work. Little, little Johnny, little Timmy, uh, and his sister, little Susie, and then mom and dad. Uh, do I have, do I have a mom and dad who look like pretentious, wealthy, um, I think the crown goes a bit far. I, I wouldn't mind using the crown, but it, it might be it might be a tad too much. Uh, all right. Well, I don't see any that work there. So what about up here? That might work. Um. So might the well? No, I don't think the purple hat person this might work but then i don't have the i don't have one for dad yeah that's okay i'm a i'm a little limited and i'm a little concerned about that um hmm i guess i could use the innkeeper all right and I guess we'll come back down here to people. Actually, let me check sci-fi. Let me check the sci-fi. Nope. I don't see anything I like. Well, I don't see anything I like. Okay. I guess uh, I'm just going to have to duplicate something I don't like. Actually, hold on. That'll work. Yeah, that'll work. That's That'll work. Okay. Save. Good. Great. Uh, we'll have somebody working in the kitchen. Where was that lady with the yellow bonnet? There she is. Okay. Good. Fantastic. So, one house down. <laughs> one house down. Oh, wait, no. I need light sources. Uh, that's all right. You know what? I'm just building it out right now. Setting the stage. We'll work on the fine details later. You guys don't need to see me do that. So I need another one. Uh, let's do... Let's do... Let's do this house. Because it's got two chimneys and it's pretty basic. It's just a rectangle. So that'll be residence. Uh, if I go left to right, that'll be B, C, D. Right. Residence D. Width will do 23, maybe. Height will be... Height'll be 17. Sure. I mean, it doesn't have to be too different. It doesn't have to be... Oh, crud. I did not edit it to be inside. Okay, that's better. Good. So what am I going to use for wall? And what am I going to use for ceiling? Can this work as a... 
I guess. I'm not happy with it. I, I think I would prefer... Huh, I think I would prefer the red bricks. I'm more concerned about the flooring because I want to set it apart from the neighbors. I want it to look not as good. Uh, oh, dang it, I messed up there. there go. And then, like so. I can put in the, uh, I can put in the front door later. Okay, so this is what I have to work with. These are the dimensions I have to work with. I think I'll keep it single story. Um, just to help hammer home that it's not as wealthy as their nearby neighbors. All right, I'm I'm starting from scratch. I I tried to build a whole thing and it didn't work and it bothered me. So I'm trying something else. Um, I might actually make the floor a little bit bigger just because it wasn't working for me. But um, let's start with the master bedroom. These two doors here, I think this will be an exit for the family and this will be an entrance for guests and stuff. So from the outside, this door will be locked. Players can't enter. But um, that means that uh, I want a dividing wall between the guest entrance and the family's only entrance. We'll have the dining room over here and the bedrooms over here. Uh, so what I want to do is set up a dining room. Uh, well, hold on. Because I lose three tiles when I do this. If I run it vert, uh, horizontally. Horizontally or vertically? I can never remember which is which, but the one that lays on its side. I lose three tiles, so I don't want to build a wall unless I'm sure I have the room for it. Okay, so this will be like an entrance, uh, and then the dining room will be up here, so I want to move it back a little more, like so. Actually... I think I'm okay with putting the entrance right there. Because then I have to put the wall there. Fine. Good. Let me put a table down. Uh, right there in the center. Now let's move it over a little more towards the wall here. There we go. Okay. Good. Now I need bedrooms. I see people walk in. I want a little hallway that they walk down before they get to their bedroom. Um, I think I want to split one of the kids off over here. So we'll do that, and that'll be their bedroom. Well, it's just so tiny, isn't it? It's just so tiny. I mean, depending on how old the kid is, they don't need a big room. But I just, I don't know. I feel like it's, I feel like it's too little for that. What if I could just do this instead? You know what? What if I, don't do that. What if I make this the big room? Okay. All right. What if I come down here like so? Come on, come on. All right. And then this is the big, this is a big bedroom. So I want, yeah, okay. Well, no, cause then the player can't fit through there. Okay, that's one of the bedrooms. We're gonna put some gaudy, horrible, Ugh, no. I mean, I wanted gaudy and horrible, but that's just ridiculous. Uh, we'll do that. Sure. That's one bedroom. Okay, okay. What about this? 
Uh, this could be where the... Uh, just another hallway. But then I need the room here, right? Um, I need a room there. But if I do... No, that blocks it off. Well, it blocks it off, but unless I move that. There, it's fine now. Okay. Ah, uh, that's not really a bedroom, though, is it? Who's going to be able to sleep in there? Ah, uh, same problem. I just don't have enough room. I just don't. I don't have enough room. Unless I move this down. I'm going to move it down. I'm going to move it down. The guests don't need that much space, right? Right? Guests don't need that much space. Maybe like... Maybe like two squares. And they'll be happy. They'll be fine. Who cares if they complain anyways? They're only visitors. Okay, so that gives me a little more room to wiggle here. Um, If I put that there, then... Bring it across. Oops. There we go. It's not much better. Not. Not much better. What if I bring this down? Um, two squares. Okay, so this bedroom's bigger, but I still got this problem here. <sighs> okay, well... Ah, I'm getting so mad about this. I just need to relax and think and think. Just relax and think. I think the problem is... I think the problem is I'm not taking... I'm not taking advantage of the space. I'm trying to segment it up, but I'm trying to segment it up in such a way that I'm just not taking advantage of the space. So let me, let me put, uh, the problem is that I'm trying to make a wall here where this door is. So it makes the room even smaller. So let's start here and just make the master bedroom. Let's put the, let's put the walls in and then worry about where everything is going to go. Okay. This is the master bedroom. I want the kids over on this side, and I want whatever else over here. So, I need room for little Johnny to be over here. I can probably... I can probably get away with this. Because I don't know what this is. I don't know. Um, actually, no, you know what? I'm going to make full use of the room. Right? That's the philosophy. So we're going all the way up. Can we divide it in half so that both kids are happy? If I put this here, there's too little room here for that. There's too little room here for that. If I put... If I put another room here, nobody's happy back here. Nobody. That could be the kitchen, though. Yeah, yeah, that could be the kitchen, though. If I put... Let me see here. Let me see if I can fit this. Like so. I guess. It's in the wall. And there's no... Ah, see, it's just too tiny of a building for that. It's just too tiny of a building for that. All right. Okay. Okay. It might just be too tiny of a building. Hmm. I got it. I'll try it again. I'll try it again. We'll do... We'll do the master bedroom this way. So that this is open. Right? Okay? With me so far? And then we can have a bedroom here and a bedroom here, okay? Um, 
I'm going to put it there so I could just put the brick wall back. Like so. Good. And this one. We will put right there. So I can just have the wall being normal. Good. Okay. Okay. Then what? Then what? What if I do this? Oh, no. I see the problem there. That's not going to work. Well, it will keep the player from walking through, right? Yes. That's an important piece for me, I guess. Keeping the player from actually using this side. Uh, okay, yeah, sure. Um, then we just cut through this. Good. So everybody has an entrance to their bedrooms. Still say this is too small, but who cares? Nobody's really living there. Nobody's actually going to be living in that bedroom. Actually, yeah, if I have the entrance here like this, the, the whole thing, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I still have a problem with this, but it's fine. Um, so what comes over here? I want the dining room. I want the kitchen, and I want like a place to relax. The place to relax could be right here, right? A couple of chairs, a nice dresser with some books, maybe. Um, I'm actually kind of limited on what I can use, but we can try. Um, hmm. I don't see a whole lot of uh, activities the family can enjoy. Oh, maybe a bird. I put uh, not right there. Right here against the wall. Okay. I still need a. Uh, I still need a kitchen. So what if I do? What if I do this? I think it's too close. Yeah, it's too close. All right. Back it up. Back it up by one. That's good. But actually, I think I want the entrance right there. There we go. Then I'll put the table in the back here. Oh, wait, wait. I want it to be right there. Okay. Tables and chairs. Good. And oh, one more, one more thing, one more thing. I forgot the beds. Yeah, it's not gonna work. Okay, I'm done. Um, I'm gonna wash my hands of this for the time being. I'm done. Uh, we'll pick it up again with the other two. Uh, I'll. I need to work on, like, some actual floor plans, I think. Uh, otherwise, I spend the whole episode second-guessing myself, and that's not fun for you or for me. Like, I'm second-guessing this right now. Look at this. Look what I'm doing. Look what I'm doing. This is terrible. Stop it. Stop it. We're done. We're done. We're, we're stopping. Just, uh All right, whatever. All right, now we're done. Uh, so while I didn't actually accomplish a whole lot, and I'm not happy, really, kind of, sort of not happy, uh, you know what, I think I'm just not happy because I haven't decorated. Once we get a clock in there, and some pictures, and some lighting, maybe a few more dressers, things will start coming together. But until then, next episode we'll work on two more houses. Until then... Thank you, everyone, for joining me. Stay safe, and God bless you.